Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am teaming up with Burberry Beauty. They do the essentials really well. They're known for their glowing skin and like the perfect nude lip, which is exactly what I'm all about. Um, so today we're going through the essentials collection that they've put together. There's a few new products that have come out. The Fresh Glow Highlighter that comes in four shades. White, Pink Pearl, Nude Gold, and rose gold. And then they also have these new um, lip color contours, which are really cool. Um, it's like a nude pen, and basically the idea is to prime, contour, and shape everything like, like in one product. There's fair, light, medium, and dark. So this look has a really glowing complexion. I've sculpted my features a little bit, like really subtly. And then obviously finishing with the perfect nude lip, which is kind of like your own lip color, only better. So let's get started. So I'm gonna start with a Burberry Fresh Glow Base in Golden Radiance. And I'm just gonna use that kind of as a primer. I like to go across my eyelids as well because we're just doing a really simple glowing look today and I like to have a little bit of color on my eyelids. And then I'm going to go in with the Fresh Glow Compact. It's a luminous foundation. This is in Ochre number 20. I really like powder foundations because I have a bit of an oily T-zone and um, it kind of just skips the step of having to do like your foundation and then setting it with powder. This color matches perfectly. So next I'm going to go in with this face contour stick. Um, so it's a contouring pen for face and eyes. Um, it's a really nice warm color and I'm just going to put it along my cheekbone for some warmth more than anything. And then on my eyes as well. I'm actually going to use a beauty blender just to blend it in really nicely. It's really nice that this is such a subtle color. Because I find you can go overboard with contouring sticks so easily. I could leave it like that or you could do just a little bit more. But it's really good to layer on the product so you can really see what the difference is. Just sculpt out some cheekbones there. Okay, um, I'm just gonna quickly do mascara. And for this I'm using the Bold Lash Mascara in number one. And then I'm gonna use the concealer stick. This is the Cashmere Concealer in Honey, number four. And I really like how instead of a, like a brush, they have a like sponge tip applicator because I just find that it's easier and um, it's much more logical for a concealer to have this because you don't wanna be like pulling under your eye skin and like brushing like that. You just wanna be like dabbing it on. around the nose as well and anywhere that gets red and then just let it sit for a second so just tap it in with your finger and then again you're not pulling at the skin and it makes sure that the color stays really pigmented which is exactly what you want under your eyes because it's normally the darkest there or at least it is for me so now I'm gonna go in with the Fresh Glow Highlighting Luminous Pen. And I'm just gonna put that on top of my cheekbones, below my brow bone. I'll put a little bit down the center of my nose. And then on the inner corner of your eye for a really nice brightening effect. Okay, and then we're gonna go in with the new Fresh Glow Highlighter. So I'm gonna use the Rose Gold number four, um, and I'm also using the Tapered Blush Brush. 
And I'm just going to brush this on top of my cheekbones and under the brow bone. And because it's kind of rosy, you can use it almost a little bit like blush and then put it on top of the lip as well. So now I'm going to use the new lip color contour and this is in number one fair. I'm just going to overline my lips a little bit. I'm actually not very good at overlining my lips and that kind of dome shape makes it a little bit easier. It doesn't really show your mistakes. And then we'll just fill it in as well. And that is the finished look. So it's really natural, um, really glowing, kind of looks like you but better which is how I always think that makeup should look I mean it's fun to experiment but on a day-to-day -day basis you just want the essentials you just want to look glowing and healthy and um, to kind of cheat wherever you need to cheat in a really quick way all the products that I used today are available at Nordstrom the Bay and Sephora um, I actually didn't know that you could get Burberry Beauty at the Bay but they sell pretty much everything. Um, so if you guys end up buying and trying them, let me know what you think. So I hope that this was helpful. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.